your day going? Mine's going good. I just spilt a hell tray of candles all over the floor, damaged the wall, and it's still under that that shelf that I've then got to remove the board of. And I need to eat at some point. another vlog this is gonna be a week-long vlog sharing things don't know yet <laughs> so this morning I unpacked some overload which you would have seen and now we're gonna pack some orders so I'm not gonna to do too much talking but I will do some ASMR not really ASMR I'm going to do non video no non, non music for packing some orders for a bit so you guys can see how long it actually takes me to do them and yeah I'll be listening to my audiobook I'm currently listening to not that you can see it uh, the Burning God by RF Kwong because I'm finally finishing the series so that's my update I'm gonna pack some orders hopefully I can get through about 20 or so yeah today's going to be my day off because it's Monday the 10th of October but I never take a day off anyway so yeah
morning now. It is Tuesday and my first step of the day is to do shipping labels. Uh, because my next step is to then go out. Uh, I have to go to the North Shore to my best friend's house. She lives a while away from me. Um, to pick up something for my mum because I'm seeing my mum on Thursday. So that is my first thing I need to do today after I get all these. These orders won't go out till tomorrow and I probably could do this when I come home. But I just like to get one step down at a time. And, uh, I was in the middle of doing these so I figured I'll finish this. I've got to be at my best friend's house by midday because she's going out after that <laughs> and then uh, I will come home. I live in Massey for reference which is in West Auckland and it's not too far it's kind of oh gosh northwest it's between it's between Henderson and Westgate and Westgate is like the furthest west north suburb there is essentially out of like main suburbs or West Harbour should I say um, so yeah we live in Massey which is Pretty far north, so I can just go on the northwestern motorway, like past Hobsonville. If you're not from Auckland, you probably don't understand. Oh, even if you are from Auckland, I've met so many Aucklanders who don't know Auckland, which is really crazy because I come from Rotorua, which is a small town, uh, small city. I know it very well. So it is kind of crazy to me that I talk to people and they don't know anything about <laughs> suburbs in Auckland. And I've lived in like Takanini, I've lived in the Central City, I've also lived in Glen Innes slash Morning, no, mm, Glen Innes sort of area. I don't know what the suburb was called because I only lived there. Meadowbank for like three months before we moved, um, me and my friend, before we moved to Glen Innes which is like two minutes away from where we lived before. So I've lived in quite a few suburbs. Never on the North Shore, but Byron is from the North Shore, so I also know that very well. And like I have a lot of family who live there, so I visited a lot when I was younger. So yeah, anyway, that's my first house for today, and then when I come home, after being out for approximately two minutes, I'm, well I am going to go, I am going to go to Warehouse Stationery while I'm out to get some things for the advent calendar. Behind this, luckily, is things for the advent calendar as well. So I'm going to start packing advent calendar stuff today. But just wrapping things because I'm going to wrap a whole lot of items like with wrapping paper. It takes me a while and I don't want to make anything like new today. So uh, a lot of today is just organising uh, stock taking and taking pictures of new of old products but new ones for the website to hopefully sell them better because some items don't sell. So yeah. That is today's task. Um, and also I've got to work on the New Zealand Soap and Candle, no New Zealand Soap Makers Association magazine because I am the magazine layout design person. Um, if you're a soap maker in New Zealand you should join the New Zealand Soap Makers Association and you get discounts on things and stuff. This is free advertising for that. And then I've also got to do um, some other stuff. can't remember but yeah that's today's task so I'm going to continue doing this and then I'm going to go out. I just got the stuff I needed, which was tape, envelopes, and some card, some board. And now I'm going to go home. I got home and my jars had arrived, so I'm going to go put them away and I'll show you. Normally Byron does this, but today I'm doing it. I think I've fallen for you And I don't know why I don't know why You love the summer rain In mid-July Mid-July My last name fits you better When I'm with you there's no pressure I miss your worn out sweaters Weather couldn't compromise our love I spent too much time on us And I think you got me stuck on love Morena, it is Wednesday And the first task I have to do today Is start on that list that I wrote last night Which you would have seen I 
and meant to start with uh, doing a test for liquid soap but I think I'm just going to start with candles and do the liquids over the end of the day because basically I can't have the wax melter on the same time I have my crock pot the surge blows uh, just for that one particular thing because the wax melter uses so much power and I'd like to get through some candles first so I'm going to go turn on the wax melter get set up for the day I've already done some stuff <laughs> um, just boring things my cat's playing in the background uh, and I'm going to try start working around 8.39 because the washing machine's on and I hate the sound of that while I'm working. So, first task is to turn on the wax melter, which I'll do for you while I'm right here. And you can hear in the background in a second the beautiful sound of the washing machine. So, yeah. Wax melt is now on. I've got to fill it up. There isn't really much wax in there. So I'll do that for now. And then I will get on to making stuff wherever my list is. Here's my list. It's a very big list, um, including perfumes, which I will do first while the wax is melting. Liquid soap. I'm going to do another test with. This is my current tester. Um, but it's got some issues as you may be able to see so I just want to do another one uh, Turkish Delight in beds uh, cause I'm doing Turkish Delight soap again hopefully I have time for Christmas and then I've got to make about 10 different types of candles but all in small quantities and I've also got a wholesale order that I've got to sort out see if I have the fragrances for it and such so and then send the order well send the draft invoice to the wholesaler <laughs> Uh, and then I will start on the order. So yeah. Couldn't compromise our love. I spent too much time on us. And I think you got me stuck on loving. You can function. I gotta tell you all my secrets. And you know that just ain't easy for me. Oh baby, won't you come to my town? Last time around, you ain't come to my house. Stay for a while, me, my mama, and my family. We'll see, let's see. I think I've fallen for you. And I don't know why. I don't know why. You love that summer rain. And it's a lie. July. I think that we're overdue. You and I, you and I. I know that we'll make it through. Telling you why, telling you why. Yeah, some rain on your tattoo. I know that nobody has you. So is it me you're running back to? I'm not ashamed to say I'm attached to you, oh no, no, no Remember those days when we sang those songs In your old Mustang that your parents bought When they spit ways and you felt alone So you have a couple people trying to make up for your broke heart Looking for love and I think that I'm a good start I know that you've been through a whole lot But I have too So baby when you're missing me and it feels right and I'm in your dreams like every night I don't know why you won't give me another chance With all our years in an hourglass, yeah I think I've fallen for you And I don't know why I don't know why You love that summer rain In mid-July Mid-July I think that we're candles are poured apologies if you can hear the dehumidifier in the back so today I poured Nezuko, Tangero, uh, Anya, Twilight, your I think this one's Nobara from let me smell it yeah that's Nobara <laughs> um, this one is Levi or Livy I don't know what people call them I call them Levi that is Mahito 
uh, Haku, Sophie, and Silco. So, yeah. Do I have labels for any of them? No. Well, I do, but like I haven't labeled them. I just have to remember by smell. And a few of them are a little bit off center, like that one. But I will fix that afterwards. So now I'm going to put them on my baker's rack right there. And then I am going to have lunch because I'm hungry. And after that, I will make some soap. So busy, busy. It is about one o'clock, I think. 12.30. So I'm just making good time, to be honest. And I've made all the candles I wanted to. And I will decorate them all later because I have to wait for them to set up, obviously. So go me. Oh, I'm gonna have to move the freaking shelf. Really? Yeah, because I think it goes behind it. It hit the I'm shelf. I'm I'm I can't see it. I wouldn't move the shelf. I can send you a picture. I mean, we can always clean the wall or fix the wall later. It's not splattered too much on the wall. I'm just worried about the skirting. Sk yeah, skirting is um, uh, enamel, so it's so easy to sort that out later. Okay. As you may have seen, <laughs> things did not go to plan. I managed to spill an entire tray of candles, which was Nezuko and Nezuko, Nezuko, honestly, and Tanjiro on the ground. I'm just a bit over it, but I do still have to make some soap, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm done for the day. Uh, well, actually, I need to pack some orders, so maybe I should do that first. No, I think I'm going to make the soap first, just get it over and done with, then pack some orders, and then done for the day. I should be done by about 4 o'clock, hopefully, because the soap is fairly easy, I think, honestly. And, yeah, well, I actually have a lot of dishes to do too, honestly. It's not my day now. It was going great at first, and then not towards the end. So, yeah, I'm going to not film for the rest of the day, honestly, I just can't think about it but I will film tomorrow. Good morning from Lux. Hello Lux. Luxie. Oh. Never mind. No good morning from Lux. Good morning from me. It is Thursday and I'm feeling better. Let me adjust this. <laughs> there we go. Um yeah after a shit day tomorrow. Oh not tomorrow. Yesterday. <laughs> Tomorrow's not gonna be a shit day. Tomorrow better be a good day. I'm feeling better. So, today's tasks are to cut up the soap I made. This is uh, just some soap that I coloured pink. I didn't fragrance it. I'm going to cut them into little squares, roll them in cornflour. I think I have to buy some cornflour. can't remember if I have any left. And those become my little Turkish Delight. Here's an example of the Turkish Delight soap. Uh, so, making some more of those. I made a lot, so they hopefully have enough for future as well. I think I'm going to make two batches of Turkish Delight because it was pretty popular last year. Hopefully people buy it. I would. I really like scent. And then I've got to finish all the candles that are on here because I didn't touch them at the end of the day. So yeah, I did manage to make my liquid soap uh, soap paste. It sits in the fridge for a while, then I end up turning it to soap. Tomorrow I have a release. I think I'm going to put a few of these candles I made yesterday on for the release. The rest of them are going up for the Labor Weekend sale. Obviously this is going up after both of those have happened, so sorry. But some of these may be available so you can check them out on the website. Otherwise, I'm also going to make some candles. And I was going to make a soap for the advent calendar, but I'm going to do that on Monday. Because it is one week until the advent calendar pre-sale closes and I've got 13 boxes left and I don't want to make another 
bar of soap with 10 left over essentially I'm going to make a loaf and then I'm going to cut the loaf in half I'm going to cut the bars and I'm going to cut them in half so they're half size bars um, so I don't really want to make because two of these will do 40, 40 advent calendars but three will do 60 and I'm only selling 50 so I don't want to make a third batch if I don't need it so I'm going to wait see if I get down to below 10 and if I don't then yeah I guess I don't have to make three batches so Monday will be the decider and then hopefully <laughs> I don't sell any more after that so yeah that's my tasks today is make some more candles finish the candles I'm going out for lunch with my mum and my brother who are coming out from Rotorua because they're going to Australia today that's my plans follow me for the day and oh the vlog will end today because I'm not I think I'm doing some work tomorrow but I don't know I'm not repeating the mistakes of yesterday, so they're not on trays. Here we have Zion Rakan, Romeo Juliet, Beetlejuice. This one is Sansa Stark, Blackbeard, which is normally only in a pack, but this time I'm doing some individual ones because I don't have the fragrance for others. Katarina and Garen. This one is oh gosh, Karen bought this one is I remember. There's a few white ones on the list, so it'll be easy to remember that one. Scooby Doo, uh, Kaz and Inej. See, some of them I only have like four of. Because I just had that much fragrance left. I don't know why I didn't just make that amount originally. But apparently I'm stupid. Uh, yep. <laughs> Seraphine, which will also be coming to Corfi Fan Fest, I think. Because there's quite a few of them. And I don't think they'll sell too well online. Restocking a lot of the party, which will also come to Corfi Fan Fest. If there is a lot left over. Um, that vlog will be coming out soon. And then Leith House, which just has a few off. So, yeah. Uh, oh, this one here is Rebel Princess. I just remembered. So, not much, but a good amount of random candles, plus all the ones I did yesterday, minus Nezuko and Tanjiro, which I managed to drop. It is 4.20 <laughs> um, and I just finished putting all the candles away. I'm waiting for one candle that I had to fix the top of. I've got to label all of my workshop pots and then I'm done for the day. So that is the end of this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give us a like and a subscribe. And just support us. <laughs> I mean, if you watched this whole thing, you obviously enjoyed it, right? Uh, anyway, that's all I have to say. Otherwise, there will be another video out next week. Don't know what it is yet. I may have mentioned during filming what it could be. Honestly, at this point, I don't remember. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Kakiti anō. Sayonara. Bye.